In a comprehensive Homeland Threat Assessment for 2024, the Department of Homeland Security DHS, warns of the increasing quality of extremist materials available online, which could potentially incite more attacks as extremists share tactics and collaborate. The report reveals a shift in DHS strategy, with the discontinuation of Periodic National Terrorism Advisory System NTAS, bulletins in favor of an annual report and NTAS advisories reserved for specific or imminent terrorist threats. The assessment highlights the persistent threat of domestic violent extremism, noting that the ideologies driving such extremism continue to be fueled by conspiracy theories, personalized grievances, and online platforms. Recent incidents and attacks, particularly those carried out by domestic violent extremists DVEs, underscore the gravity of this threat. Additionally, the assessment recognizes the evolving landscape of international terrorism, with groups like Al-Qaeda and ISIS attempting to rebuild overseas and maintain global networks of supporters. Iran remains a primary sponsor of terrorism, and state actors may seek to target the United States. CBRN threats, including biological and nuclear threats, persist into 2024, albeit with limited potential for deliberate use within the United States. The report also addresses threats to critical infrastructure, with domestic violent extremists calling for physical attacks in this area. Furthermore, as the 2024 general election cycle approaches, concerns arise about potential disruptions to electoral processes. Some extremist individuals may seek to target government officials, voters, and election-related infrastructure. Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas emphasizes the importance of the Homeland Threat Assessment as a publicly available resource for understanding the nation's security challenges and making informed decisions. The assessment serves as a crucial tool for both government and non-government sectors to address these security challenges effectively.